Hey everyone, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create this double donut chart in Microsoft Excel. First, let's have a look at this chart. It is pretty dynamic chart. If you are going to change the numbers right over here, then this double donut chart will also change. Let me show you. I'm going to change it to 30. Press enter and there you can see the section showing the Samsung percent sale becomes larger in size. First, you need to select the data like this. Go to insert tab and here in chart groups, select this insert pie or donut chart option. Right at the bottom, you can see we have this option donut. Simply click over it and there you can see your donut chart comes into existence. But this is a single donut chart. Let's click on this chart elements over here and uncheck this chart title as well as the chart legend you can also have variation of style of this chart by clicking on this brush icon and you can see there are various options given over here and even you can change the color of the chart as well now let's click over it and go to format data series and right from here donut whole size let me decrease it like this up to 50 percent and now you can see the whole size become smaller now simply click over it press ctrl c from your keyboard and again press ctrl v to copy it now you can see we have double donut chart simply click inside the chart then right mouse button click on add data labels and add data labels and there you can see the percent sales of each mobile phone company gets added to it using the same method we want to give data labels to the outer part but this time consisting of these names so right click again Go to add data label, add data labels. Again, you can see these are the same data labels, but don't worry, we are going to change them. Right click, format data labels. From these label options, simply choose this category name and now uncheck the value. And there you can see we have created this dynamic double donut chart in Microsoft Excel. And now using the chart element, we can actually add chart title. And similarly, we can also add legend. And you can also choose where you want your legend to be placed. You can put it on the top left bottom but i will stick with the right option and there it is the double donut chart is ready now so that was it for today's tutorial i hope you have found this tutorial useful please give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching